Last week, I talked about Google's new AI image generator, Nano Banana Pro, and how all Nano Banana images are embedded with an invisible watermark called SynthID. SynthID allows you to bring an image, video, or audio into Gemini and ask if it's AI generated. A few of you are curious about false positives or what might happen if you upload a real photograph. The thing to know about the SynthID watermark is that right now it's just embedded into Google AI products. And while Gemini can also examine things like file names or visual patterns, it's mainly trying to detect that watermark. And if it's not detected, that doesn't automatically make something real. It just means that that image did not come from Google. But to answer your question, I tested it and I uploaded this real photograph of my cat. As expected, Gemini confirmed it wasn't made with Google AI because there was no watermark, but that it can't definitively say whether it was made with other AI tools. It did add that based on the lighting and the textures on the fur and the couch, that it was likely a real photograph. But here's where things got a little interesting. I pushed back a little saying that I thought the image was AI because the feet look wonky. And then Gemini, Agreed. Now that you've pointed out the feet, you can see other subtle signs. And the details that were first signs of it being authentic, the fur, the lighting, were now framed as evidence of it being AI. Another question you asked was, what happens if you screenshot, flip, or mirror the image? According to Google, SynthID is supposed to be able to withstand those types of common editing techniques. The watermark is embedded into the pixel, so it should also be able to be detected through filters or smaller file sizes. Here's the Nana Banana image I used in my last video. I took a screenshot of it, cropped out the visible watermark, and then flipped it, and Gemini was still able to detect the SynthID. But the comment we got the most was, I don't wanna to have to use AI to tell if something's AI. Totally fair. I think it's good to know what tools are available to you and more importantly, what their limits are, but there's a lot you can do to verify images using just your brain and media literacy skills. Start by looking at the account and reading their profile. Sometimes it literally says AI creator in the bio. Scroll through the rest of their content. Is everything in the same hyper polished style or is there a real consistent human presence there? And if something feels shocking or surprising, ask yourself, would a legit news organization be covering this? And then do a keyword search and see what multiple credible standard-based news organizations are reporting. So yes, spotting AI images is getting way harder, but you're also not totally powerless here. So if you want more news media and AI literacy on your feed, follow along.